Well, an Oklahoma family uh, is overjoyed that they're bringing home their new bundle of joy, but their baby boy is now on a tough road of recovery, brought on by a disease that could have been prevented. News 9 photojournalist Casey Kennedy shows us the family's Christmas wish. Well, when he was born, uh, it was pretty much just amazing to, to see my little boy for the first time, and I was just happy to finally uh, have a boy. I've always wanted a boy of my own. He was just so beautiful and so perfect. It was, a very, it was very exciting for us. We noticed that he was getting a little jaundice, and uh, we were concerned about it, and so we went to our pediatrician a few days later, and, um, and unfortunately the jaundice went really untreated by our pediatrician. When he was a week old, he woke up and was just unresponsive, and he didn't, he was arching his head back, his eyes were rolling back into his head, and we were just so confused what's going on with our new baby and so we rushed him to the emergency room and they got him over to neonatal icu and immediately um put him under bilirubin lights and then gave him a double transfusion to try to get his bilirubin levels down because they were catastrophically high his was so extreme um and that's they knew at that point that that he was changed that he the brain injury had occurred <laughs> Crawling uh, is the most important thing for his brain. It helps to, to organize his, his midbrain where the brain injury is. Are you gonna go down your ramp? All right, you did it! Our whole day and whole night is devoted to taking care of him. We have five children and of course a lot of our attention goes to taking care of the baby. Right now he can barely hear. Um, he, can, he can barely see. He can't control his, the movements of his body. Stretch. So it's, it's very difficult. I mean, it's, our baby boy was born beautiful and healthy. And, and now he, he can't see or hear. Can you see it? We don't want to give him, you know, put hearing aids on him and just temporarily fix what's wrong with him. We want to heal him from the core and make it so that he's better and all good again. We just hope, we're optimistic that someday um, he will be able to lead a normal life and see and hear and run and jump. Good boy. Good boy. You did it. Oh. Oof, that just, uh, that, that, that rips your heart out. The, uh, the family is hoping to get a hyperbaric treatment machine to get more oxygen to the baby's brain. And uh, they've raised $5,000 so far, but the machine costs $20,000. And you can help if you'd like to. We've put more information on our website. Just go to news9.com slash links.